Hello guys, my name is Rohit Kumar Thakur and in this video uh, we're gonna make a beautiful custom react navigation header. You can see the result of the project uh, we're gonna build. Uh, here I use the stack navigation and the header section look quite cool. So without wasting any time, uh, let's start this project tutorial. Uh, just initialize an expo application, select the blank template and continue to dependencies downloading. Uh, next we're gonna install the react navigation library and in this video uh, we're gonna use the stack navigation so watch the video and install it accordingly then at last uh, we're gonna install the vector uh, uh, just install the vector icon library uh, which we're gonna use in this project Uh, here we have two screens uh, that is the home screen and the next screen uh, we're gonna rename the next screen as the profile screen later but before that uh, we're gonna make a, a header component so let's make a header component and set the props here uh, because we're gonna use the header component uh, for both the home screen and the profile screen Uh, first, uh, we're gonna import all the required component from the respective library. Uh, next, uh, just write the code for the stack navigation uh, for the home screen.
in the header title uh, we face the header component and set the name of the props as the home same you gonna do for the next screen Uh, next on the right side of the header uh, we want three vertical dot menu button uh, that's why uh, we use the vector icons so let's write the code for that Uh, now at last I write the minimal UI code for the home and the profile screen uh, but on the home screen I want to use the navigation button to navigate to the profile screen that's why I use the touchable opacity here uh, so that we could navigate to the next screen.
Uh, now simply run this project. Oh, here I missed a touchable opacity component somewhere. So let's uh, just add that and save the code. Uh, you can see that uh, we have a decent looking custom header uh, which we built using the react navigation uh, here i use the stack navigation uh, but you can use the same code process uh, for the bottom tab navigation and the drawer tab navigation this ui looks simply amazing and i hope you like this video so see you in the next video uh, thanks for watching this video subscribe this channel for more project based videos on react native python data science django and machine learning